hey you guys welcome back to the channel today i will be showing you guys how i get rid of gracie cradle cap so first i start off by wetting her hair now these are the three products that i have used on her hair i personally use things that are not scented because grace does have sensitive skin she, she doesn't have eczema but she does have sensitive skin so this is the brush that i bought from target i took the top of it off because I feel like I was too heavy on her head. But it's a cradle cap brush. It comes with the green handle. But I took it off. I also added in the creamy body wash. To give it um some more of a smoother feel. And then I also used the head to toe wash for the Dove. It was not scented. Now I'm just working this shampoo all into her hair. Lifting her up. Making sure that I'm putting the brush all around her head in the back and everything that may have cradle cap in it and if you like i prefer to add oil to loosen up the cradle cap so the african best oil is what i have in this bottle and i will just put it in there and i work it through her hair while the shampoo is already in her hair and it helps loosen up cradle cap and give it a wonderful smell this is the bottle i use to rinse her hair out I like it because when you put water inside of it, it applies pressure to help the shampoo to come out and also the cradle cap pushes out her scalp and out of her hair. So I love this bottle. So if you can find anything like this, I would recommend for you to get it. Excuse the scratches on her forehead. She be trying to scratch her hair. So that's why I think this video is so important because she has scratched her hair off on the sides and the back because it's just like it's a habit and it also flakes up and it itches so i just wash it the doctor told me it's fine to wash it every day if i need to um for the build up so now i'm just going through her hair making sure that all the credit cap is out all the shampoo is out these are three products that i use i use the palmer's coconut oil it smells so good i love it the vino and the hydrocortisone I used about this much on her body and a dot of hydrocortisone for her sensitive skin and a little dot of aveno for her face. Then this olive oil I use, I'm just spraying it on her hair. It's lightweight and it's better to use lightweight so you don't close her pores and cloud her pores when her natural oils coming in from her body. That's why it's not good to use Vaseline or any thick grease, just light oils. It helps the oils come in into her hair naturally anything else like thick vaseline and thick grease will basically clog the pores from the oil coming in and growing her hair so now that i have the oil all over her hair i'm just going in and brushing the back of her hair where she has um scratched her hair or her hair has fell out due to the cradle cap and i'm just brushing it and um massaging it that way the hair can come back oh now we done and she fell asleep y'all yeah, she's so cute and it helps to keep air um going to the scalp so i did this just loose um ponytail so that her scalp can breathe thank you guys for watching y'all that was sums up this cradle cap video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to the cosplay we love you and we thank you oh I like that, baby. Listen. Mm. Cobb's way. If you don't like it, get the high way. Mm -mm. <laughs>